But now I'm going to turn to my left because, but a boom, magical guest has uh, has <laughs> appeared right next to me. Uh, why don't you introduce yourself to the folks at home and also me? Hi. Oh, hi. I'm Allison Hayslip. Nice Allison, to meet you. it's a pleasure to meet you. I know your name, but I don't think I've we, we've ever actually met. I've been met. changing my hair color a lot recently too. So really, there's so many people that I, I I'm always the person that I never assume that someone knows me. Uh huh. So even if I've met them before, I'll go up and be like, Hey, I'm Allison. We met. Blah 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 blah. And so many people are like. It's something. What is? Like, yeah, I, I, I was a blonde I get last it. time we met. <laughs> or I interviewed um, uh, Rob Kaczynski earlier today, who mm -hmm. just did Pacific Rim and he's from True Blood yeah, and all that yeah, kind yeah. of stuff. Uh, turns out he's a massive gamer. Really? Would have never guessed. But I, I introduced. Did you guys myself talk to games? Him. Well, we did, but that was the thing. I introduced, I was like, hey, I'm Allison. And then we started the interview, and I'm like, hi, I'm Allison Hayslip, blah, 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 blah. And we do the whole interview, and after the interview, he goes, uh, I just realized I totally know who you are. I just didn't realize it until you said your whole name. And I was like, what? He's like, you used to have red hair. And I was like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I did. yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, I was I was hoping for a, like a little geek breakdown moment on, yeah. on Oh camera. no, he, in the interview he was like, I mean, I, this is my first Comic Con and I'm a huge nerd and like I play so many video games and I was like, you play video games? He's like, oh, I used to be a professional gamer and I was like, what? You just got so much hotter. <laughs> what did he play professionally? World of Warcraft. World of Warcraft. What? Go figure. I know. Well, it's his first Comic Con, but it's obviously not yours. No, How... this is a uh, six for me. Six. I think. Yeah. How's 2013 treating you so far? God, I love it. Yeah, it's you pretty. Know, Awesome. This is my second year working with uh, Zach Levi's Nerd Machine Company. We did Nerd HQ. Oh, Nerd HQ. We um, just sent uh, Mark. You just sent Mark Christopher Walt know, Lawrence over him. there. Yeah, he was hanging out here. Um, not sure so I this year, Zach has a. Uh, Zach sets what? his sight on a baseball field, and Zach gets a baseball field. We're set up over in Petco Park. Really? It's amazing. That's like three blocks that yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And. Um, you know, it's it's the same thing that it was for the last two years. You can go in and it's free to get in, mm -hmm. and you play all, all sorts of video games. There's these great uh, stand-up arcades, like nice. the old school stand-up arcades are there. They have um, uh, Oculus Rift. No way. The Omni treadmill. Oh my thing. goodness. So I got to do that yesterday. Now the treadmill is obviously still like a mock-up. So okay. Like, it's they don't a little have, chunky. Yeah. yeah. You still don't quite have the right shoe size yet, and like because it's only there's only one of them. The yeah. the Belt isn't modified for everyone, okay. so most of the time guys are playing it. So it's so maybe a little me, more spacious than. I, I had to hold on <laughs> to like stay in it, and they had me play Half Life 2. Mm -hmm. And like, I, have you tried that, Oculus Rift yet? No, I have not. I've I tried. Mean, it, I've tried something similar, but not right. the full on Oculus. I mean, you, you think you know what it's going to be like, and then you put it on your head, and your brain goes, "I, you're in a video game. I don't understand." It takes your brain a second, yeah, but then I once it clicks. I instantly got car sick. Actually, really? I got yeah, because your your brain just auto, like it kind of is a sense of vertigo, I and mean, then once you get a hang of it. Yeah. But that combined with the fact that realizing I had to actually walk to go somewhere, not just push a button. Not, you know, you're not just move. you know, right. you're not just looking and around and like, aiming, you're... Like, I was shooting at someone and then some dude threw a grenade at me and I was like, oh my gosh, I actually have to run and like, had to haul ass on this, this treadmill thing. Wow. And then I shot a dude in the face, like right in front of my, right in front of me and, and... you see their head explode, but here, which is way more traumatizing than when you see it out here. And then I oh turned goodness. the corner, and there was a dude right there. But he was here. Like he was right up in your face. Did I you? I felt like I walked into someone. It was. Were so you freaking scary. out a little bit? I was screaming like a little girl the entire time. <laughs> they had the whole thing on tape. I am so jealous yeah. that you got to so do that. So that's at Nerd HQ. Um, uh, that is awesome. So are yeah. you? Is, is are you mostly there, or do you get to roam the show floor uh, and I'm mostly venture there. out? I, I'm mostly there because I'm handling all their like cool behind the scenes footage that gets posted online. Nice. So I hang out because they have panels going on all day. So. Mm -hmm. I try to catch people before or after they do their panels. Okay. So we can do a fun little like, what's it like being at Comic Con? That's how I interviewed it's Rob. It's pretty Kuzinski. neat. What's the um, what's the site they can find it on? Uh, TheNerdMachine.com. Cool. Yes. Uh, and so I haven't had a ton of time. I haven't made it on the floor yet. Do you? I'm so, two blocks away. And so made when it you go to the floor. What do you go? Do you bring money? What do you go for? Oh, yeah. To are you like a action figure or like a plushie no. or a, a clothing? Clo uh, T-shirts. T-shirts. That's what I try to get. Girl after my own heart. Yes. I love the T-shirts. And I like that lately people have realized that girls buy nerdy clothing too. And maybe and it so, would be cool to have. Yeah. Something and so that I'm fits. not just buying like a Hanes giant. men's beefy shirt with like a boxy giant yeah. thing. You could fit two of that, you inside you of it. You can actually get tank tops and they look cute now. Imagine so. that. I know. Yeah. That uh, that's exciting. I wish you I wish you luck in your harvesting. You're gonna get a chance to do that. I hope so. <laughs>
<laughs> are they? Are we sending you right back to yeah, Nerd HQ go, after I go this? Straight back to work after this. <laughs> well, we're so glad you could come over here and talk yeah. Comic Con for a little bit. Uh, before we we send you on your way, uh, what you know? Have you gotten a sense for what people are really excited about this year here at Comic Con? Um, I don't know because there aren't like massive announcements this Comic-Con, yeah. which is kind of nice, I feel like. Because So not everything is just drawn around yeah. I heard one that, lightning rod. I heard that Stephen Hawking showed up at the Big Bang Theory panel. Really? Which I'm sort of jealous that I wasn't there That is that. pretty incredible. I mean, that's got that's the kind of thing that's got to be on video somewhere. Right. But oh, yeah, you, you want to sure. be there, and that's sort of the thrill of Comic-Con is yeah. getting to go to this stuff. Yeah, honestly, I look forward to the parties at night the most. Mm -hmm. Like, that's... I, I've gotten over the fact that, like... You know, because the first couple years that I was here, it was like you you run into your favorite celebrities from your favorite shows, and you're like, mm -hmm. oh my gosh, that's it. And I've gotten over the fact that that happens now. Like, I still love it, but yeah. it's not the shocking thing for me. Now it's like the amazing parties that get thrown around the town. All right, so are you going? I think I hear there's a pirate ship nearby. Yeah, Assassin's Creed. Yeah, have you seen it? No, it's I haven't. Behind the convention center. We can't we can't see the the no. masts poking up behind here, but like, uh, is it a legit pirate yeah. ship? Like when I saw it, I was like, why is there a pirate ship? <laughs> oh, there's a party on it. Awesome. Yeah, so Assassin's Creed mm -hmm. is having a party. There's a Walking Dead party where they have like an actual, you know, maze run through. Okay, so I'm doing that later tonight. Oh, you are. Yes. Good luck. Do you, have you done it before? I haven't. Damn it. But I've heard that they give you the option of going like the easy way or the really hard way. The really I'm, like, I'm a little. I want. I'm, I'm looking for tips. I like survival I know, tips. But it, I, I feel like I wouldn't be able to go the easy way because I'd be like. It feels like it's the kitty course to me. Yeah, the know? zombies are there just like, Meh. Like, I never play my games on easy to begin with. I'll, I'll take moderate. <laughs> yeah, But I'll sure. never do easy, yeah. you know? So very hard. Yeah. All right, well, uh, we're going to... don't die. Don't die? Yeah, how about that? Wise words for the zombie apocalypse from Allison Hayslip. Yeah. Uh, give us the website one more time. Oh, Nerd. Uh, the Nerd Machine. The Nerd Machine. Com. Com. And if you're here at Comic Con, head on over to the Nerd HQ. That's where she'll be. Uh, at Petco. And you might get some Oculus Rift time. And if you do, I will also be very jealous of you. Allison, pleasure Thank to meet you. you. Thank you so much for coming on stage. Thank you for having me. Uh, folks, we are now going to take a look at a very special tape segment featuring the Society for Creative Reenactment. Did I get that right? Society of Creative Reenactment. You may have sort of images of a, another acronym, LARP, come to your mind, live action role playing. But no, this is a society. Creative reenactment. You're going to see what it's all about. I'm intrigued myself. Let's go check it out. <laughs> 